because we can now log into our uh, application using the register details that we've given, we want to be able to allow the user to log out. At the moment, it's just an empty page. Now, this is extremely easy because um, at the moment, at least without the remember me functionality, it's just the um, act of deleting a particular session. So let's just jump over to our user class and let's create another public uh, function or public method and we'll call this logout. So what we're going to, all we're going to do here, this is extremely straightforward, is uh, use our session helper and we're going to delete the session, uh, this session name as we've defined and stored up here, okay, in session name. So now that that's, uh, you know, complete, we want to go ahead and actually build the logout page. Um, again, fairly straightforward if we just open that here and uh, we go ahead and require in um, core init.php. So we need to create a new user object to make use of the functionality inside of our user class. And we then just say user logout. Uh, you could check if the user was signed in before they hit this page, um, but it doesn't really matter because all we're doing is deleting a session. Um, we're also then going to redirect to uh, the index.php file using our redirect helper. So what we can now do is click log out and we're logged out. Um, again, we can go ahead and log back in and just do exactly the same thing. So logging out is extremely simple. Uh, we just create a little helper there, but we're going to need to amend this functionality when we introduce the remember me ability. So when we log in, we can check uh, a little checkbox to say um, we want to we want to remember me. So the login functionality will be slightly different because we'll be dealing with cookies as well.